Hello everyone, I'm Erica Nunez with OneStopEnergies.com and today I'm going to show you how to make your own POE Vortex Coil Design. For step one, we're going to set up two hooks 50 feet away from each other. Step two, securely tie your wire around the hook. back and forth 24 times. Step five, snip the wire from the spool and tie it around the bundle. Tightly. Step six, get your wireless drill and connect your hook to it. Step seven, now it's time to twist. Now that we use the drill to twist the wire, it's time to spool it. Step nine, find a comfortable spot because now it's time to wind the coil. We will begin by doing the counterclockwise wind first, up and over. When it met the starting point, you're just gonna skip one above it. Step 10, when you meet the starting point, now you may begin the clockwise wind. Just note that after the very first loop, you will be going directly under the starting point. Step 11. Now that the winding is complete, it is time to take the torch and melt off the enamel at the end of the wire. We are melting off the enamel, so when it's time to solder, it's easier to make the connections. Step 12. Now it's time to sand the ends and remove the burnt enamel. connected to any of the wires. 
right now we have 48 wires. So being that it made the connection, this is the finish, when this is the start. Take the finished wire and connect it to any other wire. And you're going to repeat this process 11 times. So now that I finished with channel A, this makes it one wire and I'm going to proceed to doing the same thing I did with these 11 connections on channel B. That sound is channel B completed. Now for step 14, we're going to solder all the connections. For step 15, get electrical tape and put it around the ends of the wire that was soldered to avoid the connections touching. Now that you have successfully finished wiring and connecting your POE Vortex coil, it is time for testing. We're going to take channel A and connect it to the amplifier and channel B and connect it to the amplifier. Now for the last two wires that are remaining, they are going to be connected to the 192 LED panel. Turn it on, and voila. Thank you very much for your time. This is Erica Nunez with OneStopEnergies.com. Please share and spread the word. Many blessings.